my name is George, and I'm uh, the uh, vice chairperson of uh, the uh, Skibberina West uh, West Cork SOS, the uh, campaign to maintain the ambulance service in this part of the country. Uh, so far, the government's ignored um, our concerns, and we're just to raise a bit of awareness during this holiday period. We've decided to uh, get our own little ambulance and bring a patient to Battery Hospital uh, ourselves. So hopefully the weather will be going good. Uh, we've got about 33 kilometers to do, and we're going to have a bit of fun and hopefully uh, raise a bit more awareness really to something that is going to affect everyone's life in this part of the country if they do go ahead with what they intend to, uh, removing ambulances off the roads at nighttime. Craziness. How are we doing this morning? Good, we're getting there. Brent is uh, not complaining. Brent's dead. <laughs> Stiff upper limb. How are you feeling? Oh, brilliant. <laughs> and yourself? Top of the world. Top yeah. of the world, oh, yeah. Looking forward to the second lap, you know. <laughs> To be continues. Uh, overall, well, over 33 kilometers. What's your next? Um, what's the next thing we can look forward to? What's the next stage of the plan? Not to give up. Just, just carry on the campaign, and we're just going to keep our cards ourselves. But it's not going to stop by no means. On a West Cork SOS or a website westcorksos.com, as well as uh, West Cork uh, Ambulance Save My Life on uh, Facebook. And uh, George Pindick, who are the lads with you? I'm Rob. I'm Andy. Claire. Claire. Come on, Claire, say something. How do you feel about this? <laughs> it was great fun. Great thing to do on New Year's Eve. <laughs> Andy? Well, it, if it will make a bit of difference, we, we seem to have changed the HSE mi mind on the, the bearer, Carlstown bearer ambulance, so perhaps we can do it the same for Skim. Yeah, uh, absolutely. It's, it's a vital service and it could affect you one day. Remember that. So, um, vote for it.